folks, welcome to Phone LCD Parts. Today at Phone LCD Parts, I will show you how to fix and update black screen issue after iOS 16. This device is 12 Pro Max and iOS version is iOS 16. Let's check together. Go to settings, general, soft, and the version is iOS 16. The screen on this phone is original Apple screen. Let's take out the cables by the reverse and the screen connection. Here we have 12 Pro Max QE8 hard OLED. Now I will show you exactly what's going on after iOS 16 update. Let's install this hard OLED. We connect the screen connection and the battery cable. Now I will press the power button and wait. There will be no display at all. And we have a solution to fix this problem. Let's take out the cables, battery first, and then screen cable second, carefully. Today we are going to use DLS R100. And we also have R200 on our inventory, which is the newest version. But today we will use 100. This is a multifunctional recovery device. I will add to all the links below are 200 and 100 and let's turn on the device and when you turn on the device on top of the screen you will see the current version uh, they release the current version September 16 and uh, but if you don't have the current version I will also show you how to update it those two buttons will help us to open but this device works with iPhone 6 battery if you already installed the battery, you need to press two buttons at a time to open it. If you don't have the battery, do the same step, but plug the power cable, then you will see the update screen. Let's check the screen now. Here you go. We have the update screen. Waiting for a disk, And we will use USB disk to update the version of this device, which is here. Now I will like this and it will start itself and it will go to 100% and it will reset itself after now we are ready to use top of the screen again we have the updated version which is nice to see if we have the new update or not and now let's check the screen and how we will update the screen from the current version. We got the update on the device. Now we will need to transfer this update to the screen. And I will exactly show you same screen to update. Yeah, same device, same tag, same thing. Now we will use 12 Pro Max connection on the board. Now let's connect the screen. Now, if you see Chinese on a screen, press right for English and hold the right button for the update. Now, R100 is updated in the screen with the updated version. It usually takes about um, 20 seconds to complete. And we will wait until the C writes successful. Now we have this, it says, right, successful. Now let's take off the cable from our 100. Now we will check the screen after update. We will connect and the battery. And to make sure you connect well. Now let's turn on the phone now we have the Apple logo let's wait until open
Here we go, we have the iOS 16 with 12 Pro Max Heart OLED. And I press the buttons and working perfectly. No issues, nothing, no freezing. And let's check the version one more time. General software update. Here we go, iOS 16, same device. 12 Pro Max Heart OLED, working perfect. Look at that, there's no problem in touching at all. Thank you so much for watching. This version update will 100% fix the no display issue on our 12 Pro Max QV8 screens. If you still have the same problem after update, please contact with us. And if you also have any additional questions, please do not hesitate to contact with our customer service. Thanks so much for watching. See you on next video.